guys, we are back with our Aldi Taste Test Volume 2. And as you can see, we are in a different location. We got a new house chat. This isn't some crappy like Instagram set. We got a new house, a new kitchen. So there's gonna be a lot more videos coming, not just Aldi Taste Test. There's gonna be baking videos, there's gonna be other cooking videos, more Aldi Taste Tests. But we've got quite a few to go through today, so let's get to it. The first one we're going to test out, Journey to Greeks Tzatziki Chips. These are like uh, kettle cooked tzatziki flavored chips. Okay, these taste a lot similar to, I don't know, it's kind of funny, the dill pickle chips that we tried not in the, in the first video, tastes almost exactly like dill pickle chips. But these have a better texture because these are like kettle cooked chips as opposed to just regular uh, ripple cut chips. Not bad. I wouldn't say they taste like tzatziki. I think they taste like dill chips. It's because tzatziki usually has dill in it. So it's a really strong dill flavor. So I got one. Clancy's popcorn dill pickle flavor. Dr. Goose said I had to get these today. Now these are better. This is better. These taste a lot better. A lot less strong dill flavor compared to the chips. These I could eat a lot of. Those chips, maybe a few here and there, but I couldn't eat very much. All right. I've been trying to get you to eat those for like a month. <laughs> All right. Or eat that. Next one. These are. Benton's Lemon Shortbread Cookies. Another one that Dr. Goose picked up. Ooh, they look like Girl Scout cookies. That's why I got them. There's like a lemon frosting on the bottom. And they're just a simple like lemon, I guess you could say. That's like a lemon on the top. Subtle. Very good, very, very sweet. If you like the lemon Oreos, the like Oreo thins with lemon, you're gonna love these. They're very, very good. Mm -hmm. Poor coconut macaroon, Belgian milk chocolate. I'm a sucker for a good, uh, funky chocolate. Good ice cream, ice cream, chocolate bar. This is Rainforest Alliance. Chocolate? Every time we go to Aldi now, I have to buy chocolate. I'm like addicted to <laughs> the Aldi chocolate. Not like a small child looking mm -hmm. for a golden ticket. Not like a Wonka bar. Oh, I just said that. Very strong coconut flavor. But it's not the like coconut flavor that tastes like suntan lotion. It's like legit coconut. Again, one little square is about all you need. It is quite strong, um, but it is very, very good. Very good. I wouldn't want much of it. Maybe like a quick little square after a meal would be more perfect. And then we have a late entry into our Aldi taste test. Dr. Goose and I have been craving brownies for like a month. For like two months. And so we got 97 cent Baker's Corner Chewy Fudge Brownie Mix. <laughs> it's 97 cents, how can you not, right? Yeah. So here's the pan. Very thick, very thick brownies. Cut one out on our sweet Minnesota cutting board. Let's give it a try. Great. Good. It's chewy, it's not dry. It's not too sweet. It'd be perfect with like one scoop of ice cream. Um, but for a brownie, it's not very sweet. 
This is not like too chocolatey. And it's just like fudgy enough that it doesn't taste like a piece of cake. But yeah, it's very, very good. All right, so to recap, we did our Baker's Corner Chewy Fudge Brownie Mix for 97 cents at Aldi. That was a win. That was a win, for sure. We had our coconut macaroon chocolate bar. Very good, but extremely sweet, as you'd expect. Benton's Lemon Shortbread Cookies. Excellent very, choice. Very good. Excellent, like excellent substitute for Girl Scout cookies. Right. <laughs> Don't want to buy gross up Girl Scout cookies. These are really good. Not too spendy, I remember right here. What about the same price as girls? Well. We have our Clancy's dill pickle popcorn. To me, this is the star of this of this test. It's so good! I'll be eating a lot of this. God dang you, wife. And then our wild card, the journey to Greece tzatziki flavored kettle chips. Again, really just tastes like dip. So if you're into like dill pickle chips, you would love these. So, thank you everybody for watching. If you enjoyed this video, like, comment, and subscribe. We will be back soon with All the Taste Tests Volume 3. If you like this one, check out our first one. It came out a few months ago now, before we moved to our new house. And uh, yeah, I'll talk to you guys next time. Bye!